So our third and final race here from Ascot is race 15. It's the Carey Handicap Chase. It's a two mile one event. And creaking peaking for David Ladders. Top of the pile. Pezos for Darren Thompson is two. One of us for Pontypool Racing. Capable Carlington for Martin Leadham. Fantastic Fiction for Joshua Sutherland. Hurricane Fly for Paul Rhodes. Pavilion Bury for Darren Thompson. Bulletproof for Daniel French. Eruption for Craig Beckwith. Lucky Boo for Alex Cherry. Lone Star for Paul O'Neill. Wolfhound for Derek Hinton. Hearsay for James Shea. 14 is long way for Ryan Costello. Um, all your horses always <laughs> the last number, Ryan. But the 14, the flag's dropped and they're already away. That should be fairly quick, this one. Another two mile and a furlong. Just start on the turn here. And we'll swing right handed. And line up the home straight. First of the two times. And we're going to be led by Lucky Boot. First, everybody takes it. A couple of slow jumps towards the rear. Fantastic fiction didn't get over it well. So it's Lucky Blue from Capable Cardington and Pezos. The first of the Greys. One for us. One through by Hurricane Fly. Pavilion Bure is there. Against the fence is Eruption as they go over the second. Slow jump by Capable Cardington there. The one that didn't jump in at all well was a Pavilion Bure. It's dropped right back. The rear at the moment is bulletproof. Length off the chasing, uh, I suppose the second chasing pack. We go past the winning post. And have just over a mile and a half to travel still. And it's Lucky Boo from one of us, capable carting and Pezos and Hurricane Fly together. And then a length and a half back to Creek and Peak in Eruption. Red Silks of Lone Star. And then a further length from Bet Pavilion Bury. Fantastic Fiction. All found in the Del Hinton Silks. Lawn Wave against the fence. And Hearsay and Bulletproof. We get to the third of the twelve. Everybody jumps in. There's plenty of fences to be taken. The last mile and a quarter. And it's Lucky Boo and Capable Book Hunting on one of us. And Hurricane Fly. Get over the fourth. Oh, and we've lost one there. One of us has gone. And see it is Jockey Unlucky Graham. He's not going to win three in a row. So it's Lucky Boo. By that four to Capable Carting and Hurricane Fly to get to a ditch. Oh, we've lost another. We lost two there. Creek and Peak in has gone for David Robertson and Fantastic Fiction for Josh Sutherland. All fallers at the fifth. We get over the sixth and they're finding these chase fences rather difficult. Trying to win the Carey Handicap chase. Not to 140. But it's Lucky Boo still. By about five to six now from Hurricane Fly, and he's only in second. Then they've got Capable Cardington and Eruption with a loose horse in between. And a further half length back to Wolfhound and Lone. And there's Pavilion Bury, sorry. Lone Star's a further length back from that. And we've got Bulletproof. And a couple are getting detached to Pezos here saying Lawn Wave as they go over the seventh. Everybody's over it, and it's still Lucky Boo, although his lead's down to just a length and a half now as Hurricane Fly moves alongside as he goes over that pretty slowly, so it's Lucky Boo and Hurricane Fly together by length and a half to Capable Triple Card to get to a ditch the ninth. Everybody's over it. So that was the third from fourth from home, so three to jump. There's the third from home, the tenth. They're over it, and it's still Lucky Boo and Hurricane Fly. Just on his outside, he's capable can't come. Moving out of the pack now is Pavilion Bury. Eruption, I'm not sure he's got a lot left. Running on well is Lone Star, and it's going to be between these six. The rest are well out of it, but it's Lucky Boo still leading as they swing right handed and line up for the judge. It's Lucky Boo from Hurricane Fly. Capable can't has got himself covered up, and nowhere to go. Moving out on his outside is Pavilion Bury, but it's Hurricane Fly that heads for home. Oh, poor jump there by Lucky Boo has allowed Hurricane Fly and Capable Carnton to take it up. It's these two as we come down at a quarter mile from home. It's Hurricane Fly, two to jump from Capable Carnton. Lucky Boo, they get to the last. It's Hurricane Fly, Capable Carnton running on still now. It's Lone Star and Pavilion Bury, but Hurricane Fly is well over the last. It's got a three or four length advantage as they come inside the final fern and Capable Carnton's got nothing left and starts to go backwards. Low, Lone Star's running on well. Pavilion Bury, but it's a win for Hurricane Fly. Well named. Takes the carry handicap chase for Professor Rhodes. And Lone Star in second, Kevin Collins in his third. Fine car to come up. And this Paul Rhodes takes it with Hurricane Flight. Ten to one shot. Nice bit of money there if you had some on it. Lone Staff Paul O'Neill was second. Third was Capable Cardington for Martin Leadham. Fourth was Pavilion Bury for Darren Thompson. And running on for fifth was Bulletproof for Daniel French.